Okay, I wanted to show you how to set up Lightroom. Um, once you have installed it from the uh, software center, um, you're going to need to have each student log in and choose a location for their Lightroom catalog. I always suggest that we use Lightroom from the um, Microsoft menu. Notice that there are two Lightrooms. We do want to select the one that says Lightroom Classic. Now, um, I've previously had a catalog that I deleted. It's giving me a message that it can't find the catalog. There will be a similar message um, uh, about putting, not being able to use the catalog. What you want to do is choose the button that says choose a different catalog. And on this uh, pop-up window we go and we do create a new catalog. Now, the recommended location for the catalog would be in the user's pictures files. But by default, this goes to the home directory. This is not on the C drive of the computer, so we need to actually navigate to the C drive. And to do that, we have to come down to the Windows C drive, click on that, go to the users folder, find your name. Uh, anybody who's logged in to that PC will have a folder for their login name. Here's mine. And then I just come down here and choose this pictures. And it will look like this on the top. Okay. Just to contrast that, I'll click on the picture shortcut that's up here. Notice how it changes. Did you see the change? If I go back down here and I'll have to navigate to it again. That's C drive, Windows, users, uh, my username, and pictures here. Okay. And then I give it a name. I'll just call it uh, Lightroom Catalog. And then I'll click on Create. And then Lightroom opens up and you'll be able to import pictures and you will be able to um, um, work with them and create albums and such. However, the downside to this is the student will have to go to the same machine every time. So I hope this was helpful and feel free to email me any questions about uh, installing this and getting the catalog set up.